this is my webhook testing page and I see all these links these are payment actually I requested for I'm just choosing a random one and I'm entering my URL not my webhook URL but just for testing purpose I just want what response I'm getting from Instamojo for this request this is the response I got from Instamojo it tells me status is credit let's choose another random payment request still the status is credit so I am creating one more payment request here it's called flaw01 so the request has been created if I refresh this page then you must see it there it goes flaw01 now I have just created this request the process has not been done and clearly the money has not been credited obviously the server should not show me a status called credit but let's see what's happening status is credit I have not even processed the request so I think this is a kind of flaw but one thing that I would like to inform you is webhook request is only sent when actually the payment is done when all credentials are entered and when you are redirected back to website I am supposed to enter password and I am supposed to click it here but what happens if instead I click cancel so it is asking me whether I have to cancel for sure yeah I have to Takes some time and doesn't even redirect back to our home page telling us the payment is unsuccessful. It's also giving us the date, time, and uh, the payment ID. But here in webhook, if you send a webhook again, then the status is credit. However, we have a solution for this. Guys, if you guys think that this is not a problem and uh, there is some logic behind this please let me know if you are not subscribed yet please hit that subscribe button thank you for watching and you guys have a great day